one. What's up, everybody? It's Kaiser Axe, and joining me on the table, we've got... Grinch Tori and... Yeah. Yeah. Welcome back to another episode of the Maverick Duel Type Tournament. In today's episode, we have the Battle of the Suns. We have my son, Azadi, versus Zach's son, Music. Whoever loses is getting disowned. That is all we will say. <laughs> the other, and, then me, and then me and Ox are going to beat, beat each other up, except I'm bigger than him. So, uh, yeah, gonna, we'll beat uh, each other up. I'll beat him up emotionally. He'll beat me up physically. <laughs> but uh, enough about us. Uh, let's get into our son's battle. Glenn, how are you feeling about both of our teams? I am seeing some Pokemon that I don't usually see, like the Arctazolt for one on uh, Nem's side, and I'm also seeing that Alolan Golem on the music side. Can I expect an explosion, please? Also, can I, can I think it's funny that we see two starters, one starter on each side? Oh, that yeah. And they're both starters that get a Hisuian form. Yeah. Well, well, what we, uh, well, here's the thing. I see a, I see a Hisuian Samurai, and uh, we all know yeah. that if you if you choice scarf that bitch, uh, that bitch do things. It's a problem. Just so pray it, that it, you hit the speed to be scarfed. Yeah, and then looking at looking at uh, music team, he's definitely bringing that Toxapex once again, and the Magnezone. So I guess he's hoping those two Pokemon will help save his ass. Well, there is a Baxcalibur over there, and let's be real, Baxcalibur is a freaking problem for most Baxcalibur people. Baxcalibur is possibly looking forward to sweeping everything that music has. But aside from that, I, I I see the uh, the bomb of snow, and I'm guessing that's going to be a Mega Pokemon. Come on, Mega! I'm so excited because I... Mega Bomb of snow is underappreciated, but I get... But now with the buff to, um, to snow and whatnot... It makes it even more tanky, which is like it needed it, you know. Yeah, I wish no, it. Uh, it wish right. it helped me it, though. If it, did, if it didn't get it, it, it would just be sad. It would yeah. be sad. But anyways, guys, you want to hop into the battle with me? All right, time to see yeah. whose son is better. All right, my son. My son Whoever better. loses gets disowned. Ha <laughs> ha! Alrighty, let's see what's gonna happen. Just gonna let who down. Alright, we see the iron bundle. Oh, it's the shiny versus, variant too. Let's go. Versus the monkey. Monkey. Why the iron bundle though? That's the only thing that really confuses the hell out of me. I think it's mostly because iron bundle can hit hard and it has access to free strike or something like that. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, actually, no, yeah. wait, never mind. I'm thinking the other way around. Acrobatics? Why acrobatics? Wait, hold on a minute. No idea. That does not have. This thing does not have good attack. Why on earth would you use acrobatics? I have no idea. Did yeah, you, I mean it was did nice. Did you look over his team with him? Uh, kind of. Wow. Yeah, def definitely, definitely so, nice though that he tried to at least proc it with the uh, you know, with the booster energy. Yeah, but, but yeah, it, it just, it just because, doesn't. Just because you lose the booster energy does not mean you should throw. Oh no no yeah 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 but I mean. Uh, like, oh, that yeah. was uh, that that monkey is gonna fuck things up. Monkey. Monkey picks up the first kill against the Iron Bundle. Ooh, shiny Hisuian Samurai. If that Samurai uses Ceaseless mm -hmm. Edge... Oh, ah, and it hit! Unfortunate. Oh, unfortunate. Oh, Ooh, damn. okay. Damn. You gotta hit. Damn. You gotta damn. hit. You gotta hit. 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 Have you shoot it? No! Oh, the the miss! Oh, the Ooh, fist. it's still alive! Hit. Hit. <laughs> hit. Oh, hit. you better hope you get that hit with Ceaseless Edge, brother. Hit again! Hit it this time! Come on! Hit! Hit! Oh, go for broke! Yeah! Let's go! I'll be honest with you. I guess he he thought maybe I get more um more damage in with the rage fist since oh, oh, wait, bird wait, judges on, you. Wait, Nam! Wait, Nam! Nam! Wait! Hold on! Wait! I mean, we don't know. Maybe he might pull out some sort of terror or something. I might have shadow sneak. If you have shadow sneak, I think you can probably get the KO too. I think. No, against resisted. I don't think so. Ooh! And Bob goes the decidui. Uh, my son, what are you doing? Why are you sending out your ghost Pokemon? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hold on a minute. Hold wait, on wait, that something. means it's not a choice either then if you use Sucker Punch just now, right? Oh, sheesh. Nope, not choice at all. Wait, not a choice, Samurai? Ooh! Oh I'm kind of. I don't know what he's oh, using really. now. Son, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, you should have not. Oh, I don't know if this is gonna live. 
Come on, Mega Evolve at least. Come on, let me see the Mega Evolution, please. Well, you never know with the snow up. Are you talking about the the Zebra or the or the Obama snow? There it is. Oh, oh, oh. oh, Secret Sword! It lived. Earthquake. It lived. Managed to pick up the kill. It need. It, he should have brought this out a long. Though. Yeah, he should have brought this out way before the other two goes. Zebra Aura. Oh, wait, wait, oh. Yeah, you, just killed, you, you just killed your thing. No, no, oh. you just killed your thing. Slush Rush? Is it running Slush Rush? I would wait, imagine it's Slush Rush. Wait, Deb, no, no, don't bolt be. Oh, okay. Is anyone else as confused as I am? I am very confused. What is my son doing? Why did he. Wait. Well, I'm assuming he also had heavy duty boots there, too. <laughs> Amarok picks up another, picks up another kill. Oh, ice shard! Oh, you do ice shard? Ice shard? Ice shard? Question mark? Stellar type. Wait, Nem. No ice shard. Nem. Nem. Glaive rush. Nem. Nem. No. Nem, what are you doing? <laughs> ice body. No. What did you? No, Nem. Nem, no. What are you? Earthquake. Doing? Oh my god. Earthquake. Oh shit! Oh, okay, oh. Well, at least he didn't touch it. As Why long as he doesn't go for the, eh? as long oh, as he doesn't go right, right, right. Rush. He Why went, he went bug terror. I have no idea. Oh, it's still live. Loaded, really even wait, has loaded dice wait, on. Hold wait, on. Wait, wait. <laughs> no, no, you have no excuse. You have no excuse. Oh, he's poisoned. Ooh. And Ooh. there's the game. Talk about kills the back caliber. <laughs> This game was this is some a fun game. This is a fun oh, game to watch. What the fuck? This was some sort of bullshit. Like <laughs> that was, was a bullshit. Fun. What the hell Wait. was going on? <laughs> yeah, that was a fun game. Wait, what? I'm I'm so confused. I'm confused. Like, why uh, ice body Excalibur? I think he wanted to make it a bulky variant, but you the can't. thing was. You can't. Not what you make it stellar. No, you stellar technically you have can. Defenses. But anyways, we have our players back in the call with us. Congratulations, music on the win. That is your first win of the season. Let's go, buddy. That went very better than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, how, going into this match, how did you feel going up against your good friend, um, Mem? So, the one typing that was... <laughs> At first, I thought it was going to be an issue was ice, but then I was like, I know I have the mons where I can deal with that in some sort of regard. It was a ghost that was the weird thing, because I know it can have so much different back and forth mm -hmm. of just what it can have the dual type with. That was the one thing I wasn't sure of. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Ghost types tend to be tricky, but I mean, like, that proved no problem for your Samurott. Speaking of ghosts and Samurott, my son... <laughs> What the fuck were you doing? <laughs> Why did you switch out all your ghost Pokemon against the Samurai? I don't think he is. Ma'am. I see him here. I, I have no words because I was like when I because again that was that's a mon I'm not used to. Well, th th that's the issue. I had a lot of the things. I'm like, a lot of these, like, I shit you not. There's probably only two on your team that I had an idea what the hell they were. I know, but he also showed the sucker punch. My son. I'm really digging it's... shiny. I need to get a shiny. Also, like, honestly, now I'm kind of surprised you went you went for a rage fist instead of a drain punch. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Excuse me. But. That was definitely an interesting and fast-paced game. Like, things just die left and right. I thought it was going to be a lot longer than this, honestly. I thought it was going to be down more to one-to-one, -to -one, honestly. I, looking at your teams, it should have gone down to that. But, like, I guess, like, things happen. <laughs> uh, the Bug Terra, definitely on your top specs was nice. That was, that was a nice touch on it. I was thinking about it afterwards because the amount of times I've been earthquaked by my water mons and it just like kills them. Like I was needing something that was gonna help. Hey now, I have a question. Uh -oh. Why the fuck did you stellar terra type? What is stellar? That's the first I've Not, seen. That. It doesn't change your actual type. 
So what does it do? So it boosts it... all of your damaging moves by 1.2% instead of... However, only the first time you use them. Yes. Once uh, you use uh, that type uh, of damaging move, it's uh, you don't get any more boosts. Uh, it also changes your Terror Blast into Terra Stellar, which says you deal super effective damage to Stellar uh, to any Pokemon that has Terrestrialized. The however, downside to that is that you get decreased in both your attack and special attack by one stage. The only Pokemon who oh. really are Stellar Terra type are those that have Contrary. Yeah. Or Terrapagos! Stellar is meant to be a highly offensive type if you are if you have the right way of running around with it. If Ooh. you if you uh if you try to stellar Terra as a defensive Terra, it doesn't actually change your type. You st- your weaknesses are still still the same. Huh. And that is the problem. Think of stellar like super normal. That's how I look at it. Yep, yeah, that's actually a very good way of looking at it. Seems like a Slightly bulky, normal, but not by much. Yeah, eh, eh. It, it's more. It's more so to give you that edge against any Pokemon that has terrestrialized, because you know terrestrialization gives you that like that edge of like, hey, now you're not doing super effective damage on me, but now I can do super effective damage on you because I'm Stellar Terra. Makes sense. Yeah, it's got its ups and downs. But definitely, also, that was an interesting match. Also, Ice Body Backs Caliber is kind of odd. <laughs> On who? No, so <laughs> the reason why is because Max Caliber, the reason why people say fuck using Ice Body over Thermal Exchange is because Thermal Exchange fixes a big problem that dragons often come across being burned. Yeah. Well, I mean,. I guess, I guess for Nim's sake, he probably thought, "Hey, he's not running any fire Pokemon, so I'm just gonna, you know." Why wouldn't run he? It. There's, he could have had access to Volcanion. True, Volcanion, Rotom Heat. Yes, Volcanion's a water fire. What? I didn't even think about that. <laughs> oh, uh, Glenn, you got anything to say to our players? I had fun watching the battle. Honestly, I was. Like, it's nice to see, like, people that, um, like, trainers that have, like, either, like, you know, they haven't played for a long time or, like, they, they're just coming back in or something. Like, I, I love seeing their battles, like, like those people battle, and then, like, sometimes they don't know about stuff. So, like, it's kind of interesting to see, like, what they find out later on, like, either during or afterwards and their experiences with it. And it's, like, it, it kind of gives me, like, a refreshing, like, like taste in my oh. mouth, like... It's like this is this, this yeah. yeah like this is what I like to see like like these people like they're they're having like this new experience is like something like they probably experienced with like when they're you know from from before and then you know they're kind of like trying to find their inner Pokemon trainer again kind of thing. Yeah. That's okay. And that's, that's what, what I've been doing. That's legit what I've been doing with it because it's like like I said it's been so long since I've done battling in this regard like like my legit knowledge is pretty much like beginning of five and then that's it. Well, here's yeah, what I know, and I do. Mine's up to three. Here, I'm gonna say this though. You ready? You ready? You ready? Mm-hmm. Axel, my son beat up your son. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> you, I won through him against you. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> and I'll be honest, I legit was gonna use a whole different team, but I was just like, no, I need something that just is gonna be more tanky. Because the one guy I was originally gonna have was not. Super tanky at all. Like he was good for a thing, and that was it. I mean, it's good to have some tanky Pokemon, but you also got to have that offensive edge or strategic edge, whichever one that suits your yeah. style. But I mean, whatever you did with your team, music, it helped you win. So congratulations! That is your first win of the tournament. That has put you at one and four right now. So your differential, yeah. looking at all your scoring, is minus nine. Unfortunately, though, you are still last place because yeah. of your because of your scoring. Hey, son, of course. Hey, son. Guess what? Hmm? Guess who's your next fucking opponent? Is it you? Watch it be you. I swear. I'm I'm checking right now. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> Music. Your next opponent will be Sim. It'll be your electric water versus his steel and flying. How do you intend to, you know, prep for that team? 
I feel like I'm going to have a good read on the steel, the flying ones. You know, I have to think about. You have a raging bolt. You have that's the advantage, have if anything. At least. You have a raging bolt. That's all I have to say. <laughs> and then, <clears throat> Nam, uh, with that loss, that puts you at one and four. And your differential is minus eight, so you are in 11th place, and music is right on your ass right now. <laughs> I thought, oh, what? I thought he was a little higher, if I'm honest. I haven't been keeping he, up with the scores. He yet. actually was higher. He was ninth place, but that loss put him down because you guys are the only matches that have been done in week five right now. So uh, you two have like the higher lose, uh, the higher ma- uh, number of losses compared to everyone else. So you're at the yeah, bottom. yeah. And then <sighs> Nam, looking at your next opponent, you're going to be challenging my good buddy Titus. It's going to be your ghosts and ice types versus his fighting and fairy types. How will you prepare for that? I really need to think through about fairy. That's going to fuck me up. Yeah, think about fairy. That was an issue I had. Fairy there was is a lot my of biggest what... issue. I yeah. that one's still I'm getting used to. It. It's like what the hell is fairy and I'm fighting? Against? Oh my lord, against ice. I... I yeah. mean, you do have the advantage with the ghost types. Sure. Yeah. yeah, that'll be your biggest save on that. It's just careful with fairy. Because yeah. that was but an issue I had with myself. You guys can... You guys, I feel like with how you two have been playing so far in the tournament, you're still learning, and you're going to keep learning and keep growing. And, you know, you're going to win. You know, you can win more matches. Although, looking at the rest of the tournament, you are entering week six with four losses. If either of you secure one more loss, I'm going to have to say, sorry, you're not making it into playoffs. Yeah. Yeah, so this is... I'm completely fine, even if I don't make playoffs again. It's still a learning experience for me. I know, but you want to go to playoffs. That's the goal. that's That's the goal, make it to playoffs. So... Don't I like, like I know I understand like you're happy with just playing the game and whatnot, but like you gotta remember this is a tournament too. You gotta aim for the top. Oh, of course. Yeah. So good luck to you guys in your next matches, and hopefully you know you can secure the win. Keep yourselves in for the racing of the playoffs. Zach, Glenn, do you have anything else to say before we sign off? My son beat your son. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I have nothing else to say, actually. <laughs> Alrighty, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Doing so lets us know that you have been enjoying these videos. Subscribe to both mine and Glenn's channel. Link will be down in the description down below. Be sure to check out the rest of the um, the dual type link, as well as the rest of our Pokemon tournaments that we have with the Mavericks. All of those are really fun, and stay tuned for the rest of Week 5 matches coming up at, in the next coming days. Until then, we'll see you later, gamers. Bye! Bye-bye! Bye-bye.